Welcome back everyone, Kara here again with Explore More Worlds. <laughs> Thanks so much for tuning in. We are sharing with you in this episode Rockefeller Center. This is actually December of 2021, so just last year, but thought we'd go ahead and share this with you guys, especially for those of you who may be planning a trip to New York City this holiday season. And definitely stick around through the entire video guys because we are actually sharing our entire um, evening late evening by the way it's about 11 p.m. at this point so we are sharing our entire evening all the way up until we get back to our hotel which was the courtyard by Marriott um, in Manhattan Midtown so definitely stick around guys we've got some great stuff for you Now we did not go ice skating this time at Rockefeller Center. That may be something we check out next time. Um, but you can always go to the website RockefellerCenter.com. The tickets I believe go on sale in the fall. So they haven't started yet, but definitely keep an eye on the website for those ticket prices. Santa is over there getting down. <laughs> So Rockefeller Center is located at 30 Rockefeller Plaza in New York, New York, and the tree is lit daily from 6 a.m. until 12 a.m. On Christmas Day, the tree is lit for 24 hours, and on New Year's Eve, it is lit from 6 a.m. to 9 p.m. If you are spending your holiday season in New York City with kids or you just want to let out your inner child, you definitely want to stop by this awesome toy store, FAO Schwartz. I am sure all of you have heard of it before or at least the majority. This store is pretty awesome. I do have some other footage walking through the, uh, this store. I'll try to get some of that together to make another video, but from the looks of it, as you all can see, Lots and lots of toys and candy. <laughs> Just a warning before you take your kids inside. <laughs> is the Rockefeller Center Magnolia Bakery. Of course, since it was so late, they were closed. <laughs> but really, really good treats and desserts here, guys. And you don't even have to be in New York City to get your hands on their goods because they do ship nationwide. Maybe not everything, but a lot of their iconic desserts you can order and have it shipped right to your door.
Oh my gosh, guys, I apologize. Oh, that's terrible. I apologize for all the shakiness and all of that. We are kind of like walking, running across the street. Ugh, so sorry. Obviously, we don't have any type of stabilizer or anything like that for our phones and GoPro. Um, we will do better, okay? We will do better. <laughs> but anyway, we are here um, checking out the really big red ornaments in New York City. These are located at 1251 6th Avenue, and they are really, really awesome. This video really doesn't know justice. They're pretty cool. These giant candy canes can be found along 6th Avenue between 50th and 51st Streets. These huge nutcracker statues are located at 1325 6th Avenue. It is super late, so now we are going to take the subway back to our hotel. And yes, we definitely had a conversation with our nine-year-old in regards to homelessness and the reality of the world around him. And I definitely recommend, you know, if you have younger children um, or even older children who are not used to seeing things like this, if you bring them to New York City or take them to any large city, um, just have that conversation with them. I mean, it's real world out there, guys, and they deserve to know how the real world looks and works. So definitely have that conversation before visiting New York City, especially if you plan on taking the subways at any time.
now we are back at the courtyard here in Manhattan Midtown um, really nice hotel we didn't have any complaints or any issues staying here um, pretty secure and safe so definitely check the description box below because I will have some information in regards to this hotel if you're looking for somewhere somewhere to stay while you visit New York City Hi guys, we had a fun eventful trip to Rockefeller Center. Yeah. And then we finished it up Here right goes, there Andy in Music Sherman. City. What'd you say? It's Andy Sherman. Andy Sherman? What? Andy Sherman. <laughs> Monday night. <laughs> Um, I have no clue who Andy Sherman is, but, uh, yeah. <laughs> and that pretty much wraps up our late night adventure. I definitely recommend, um, if you're wanting to avoid some of the larger crowds, to head out late night or early in the morning like we did in our Bryant Park video um, especially if you are going to Rockefeller Center or you're wanting to walk around and check out the holiday decor late night or early early morning is the best time if you enjoyed this video which we hope you did feel free to give us a thumbs up on it and of course we'd love to have you here so we always welcome you guys to subscribe if you feel it <laughs> I hope everyone has a good night and we will catch you next time.